Hey guys, welcome back to my Pokemon Sword Nuzlocke challenge. This is part 4 of the series, and if you haven't caught the rest of the videos, I highly suggest you do so. Also, if you want to catch me live, just go to twitch.tv slash justmeeks. All the links are in the description below. In the last episode, we defeated Kabu, which put us further than we have ever been before in any Nuzlocke run. Before we continued on to Route 6, we decided to go back to the wild area and find a Thunderstone, where we can use to evolve OJ into Vikavolt. Vika Volt, that's pretty sweet. We then continued to Route 6 where we bumped into Team Yell, whose objectives I never really fully understood. These are the like weirdest antagonists ever. Hey, if you're not loud, I'll let you through. Okay. Yeah, of course we're gonna battle them. Who just goes around screaming on pathways? Like who's who's loud on their own? I guess this guy, never mind. So what was their objective here? Like, were they trying to get people to not be loud? So, by virtue of me battling you, wasn't that loud? But yep, I'm nothing what Team Yell does makes right. any sense. Anyways, we carried on the route and we found our next encounter, which happened to be a Hippopotus. Which we caught and named Busted because that's one cool sounding name. On the way to the next city, we ran into this trainer, which happened to be a little more than we can handle. Here's how it went. grass type and I would actually lose my mind. He looks pretty pissed. Oh shoot. Actual worst play. Actual worst play. Okay, um... Let's swap out- Who, who's poison? Hey, uh, kills anyway, so I think we're okay. Rocky can tank it. This guy's an animal. Rocky's an actual animal. That was a crit too. No way. Oh, I use Rock Slide on the artist. Oh, Pseudo Udo. Oh no. Yeah, I'm gonna go with the Rock Slide. You sly bastard. Literally hit him with the Uno Reverse Guard. I should throw up some Iron Defenses. I'm actually really surprised I'm not missing these right now. That could kill next turn. Let's risk it for the biscuit. Let's go. Hit. No. Okay. Okay. Now we heal. We're in big trouble here. We're in big trouble. Stop hitting me. Rock slide, hit, hit. Or you know what? Let's try it with the rock slide. Let's just do it. And he hits! I thought he hit. Rest in peace, Rocky. Hopefully Taco can hold it. Oh, you're right. Rock slide is rock. I'm an idiot. Where does it say that? In the name, rock slide. <laughs> That's actually hilarious. Why? Why? That was a big bra moment. Oh. Fingers crossed, baby. Let's see. OJ's got to hit him hard. Never go for bug bite. And we're good. Yeah, bug bite. You know what? Next time I get a, a move, I'm going to get rid of it. We lost two. We lost two of our favorite heroes. We do one last salute to our fallen Pokemon, Taco and Rocky, before we send them off. We finally made it to the town of Stolenside, where after the last battle, I realized that our team was severely underprepared for the next gym battle. So I decided to go back to the wild area and do some max raids for some candies to level up our Pokemon. We got Barton to evolve into Toxicatry, Nayuda to evolve into Leopard, and Dex to evolve into Excadrill. 
With that, I think we we're finally ready to take on the gym, but not without a battle from Hop, who we easily clap to make way for the next gym leader, B. Before that, we had to go through the gym challenge, where we fought enough trainers and ended up evolving Busta into Hippodon. Oh baby, he's a tank! We are finally fully prepared for the B fight, and this is how it all went down. Yeah, it's true. If Barton OJ dies, we got Excadrill, which is a pretty good Pokemon. Okay. Let's go B. Okay, so I'm going to walk in with, with Discharge. Immediately Discharge. Uh, we're going to have another Discharge I should kill. Okay, perfect. So we're in business, boys. We are in business. Pangoro. Okay. Should I heal? Should we heal for this or no? Is there, is there a calculation? Like, can we survive this can he smash a 73 it might go for workup to try nuzzle he does hit hard nuzzle might be the play nuzzle might be the play if he goes for the workup we can go for the nuzzle get a little bit of hit there and the par paralysis i love pangoro he's an awesome looking pokemon i have a i have a pancham in my party we're not my party he's in the box so i'm, I'm excited for him to evolve Okay, we're gonna roll those dice. We're gonna nuzzle into a discharge. We're gonna roll the dice. Okay, I'll take the crit, no problem. Night slash. Oh geez. Yes, let's go. I'm gonna throw down a discharge. Let's go! Circle throw? That's not gonna do jack. Okay, beautiful. And we're good. Oh, wait. No, I forgot he does that. Oh! <laughs> yes! Let's go! That's actually best case scenario. Oh, thank you very much. Literally just hose him. Just hose him. <laughs> Oh my god, that was like worst case scenario for him. He literally just pulled out my absolute beast. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna Dynamax and Max Lightning. Boys, we got this in the bag. We actually got this in the bag. I actually can't believe that just happened. <laughs> I totally forgot Circle Throw swaps a Pokemon. I, I didn't even see that coming. Yeah, basically. Stab, Max Lightning, Wise Glasses, plus Special Attack. You're basically your host. You're actually host. I don't like the fact that it's... Uh, okay, whatever. You're dead. Yeah, I, this is worst case scenario for B. I think she just lost. Yeah, you're dead. That should be a one hit. Yep. Well, I mean, we're in it. We got to go for it. We got to kill Machamp fast. That's the, that's the whole goal here. Dude, Gigantamax Machamp looks badass. Like, come on. He looks like an actual force. Okay, Max Strike. Ooh, I don't like that. Okay. We got it. We got it. We got him. Oh, no. Speed, of course. That's okay. Doesn't even matter. I'm already slower than you. Come on! Oh, shoot. Okay. Okay, he's gonna hit first and probably kill. Bustic might be able to take a hit. That's actually not a bad play. Yes, he does. So we can swap out Busta, take a hit, throw the Sandstorm, and he's got Sand Rush, so he's got super speed. And we can hit a dig. Okay, let's do it. Busted should be able to take a hit. He's, he's a tank. My worry is when I switch Excadrill in, will he kill me? Immediately? Yeah, we're good. Of course he crits. Why wouldn't he? Special defense fell. Okay, that's cool. Hit with the Sandstorm. So long, Busta. 
<laughs> Let's go! Let's go! Oh no! <laughs> That's okay. F in the chat, boys. F in the chat. Gone, but not forgotten. Gone, but not forgotten. Wow. With the heroic sacrifice of Busta, we managed to take down B and secure our fourth gym badge. And with that, I think it's a good time to end the episode. Thanks so much, guys, for sticking around. If you want more content like this, come check out my channel. And if you want to catch me live, just go to Twitch TV slash JustMeeks. We'll catch you in the next one. See ya.